So how to structure and set up the A plus content on Amazon Seller Central. When it comes to selling on Amazon, we all know that, um, and if you don't know this, uh, you know, this is the time where um, you should know about this, about A plus content, because you're going to hear it a lot. Um, you know, if you're taking an, an Amazon FBA course, or if you're, if you're getting familiar, um, if you're getting the, your, the ball rolling with uh, on this Amazon FBA world, you're going to um, hear about this a lot, okay? So, um, uh, in this video, we're going to see how to structure, how to set up the A-plus content on Amazon Seller Central. Because, um, you know, you, you do it from the actual Seller Central, but there's a lot of questions. Um, I mean, based on my experience, uh, there's a lot of questions that uh, people always come up with. And I've found that, you know, they are all related on how to structure and set up the A-plus content, okay? Like where to do it on Amazon Seller, Seller Central and like, kind of like this step-by-step. So basically, this is pretty easy. This is pretty straightforward. It's pretty user friendly, just like anything on Amazon Seller Central, right? It's pretty, it's pretty view, um, uh, visual. Okay, like you, you can, you can see that it's, um, you know, it's nice doing it. So basically, this is exact, um, the exact step by step that we're gonna, that we're, that we're gonna um, do. Okay, so we're gonna just copy A plus content, and we're just gonna look it up. Like we're gonna straight up look it up here, click search, and then it's gonna um, A plus content manager. So this is exactly how you do it. We're gonna follow this step by step, and I'm just, and I'm just gonna show you guys how it's done on Amazon Seller Central. Okay. Once we are here, we're gonna click on start creating A plus content here. I don't know if you guys can see it. Um, top right corner on your screen. Uh, we're all we're always gonna have like the same same page. Okay, same website, obviously. So just click that. You can also do like by you know your ASIN or product name. But I mean, if you're if, you're, if this is like your first time doing it, which is pretty much ev all you know, which is pretty much everyone's case here. So then start creating A plus content. Uh, we're gonna click on create basic. This is pretty much how a, how it looks like when you are. Um, you know creating um, like setting up your a plus content Z there is enhanced product description and which is like you know the basic and create up to five modules of enhanced content to highlight the features of your product so that's basically what it is this is the one that we're gonna do okay spoiler alert this is the one that we need I mean you don't need more than this this is like way more than enough and but then it's also good to talk about the additional content types okay um just so you guys are aware just so you know um it's to like to the brand story so you can just tell your brand story across all of the products in your brand as your logo brand picture brand description and answer questions about your brand content displays in a new section above the enhanced product description so you can just create the basic or create a brand story so in this case we're just as, as i said we're gonna click on create basic because that's um i mean that's all we're gonna do we're not gonna do like anything you know fancy anything complicated um not really this is pretty easy okay so then once we are here we're gonna click on add module so what that means is that basically we're just gonna start with the content okay so if we like i mean this is the um next step add module one two and three four and usually people have around four or five but depends on your, on your product okay and this is pretty much it okay so now we are here on the company logo you guys are gonna have a lot of uh, options okay a lot of like variations uh when it comes to like you know your product it's gonna vary a lot okay it's gonna vary on what you want on how you want to present your product on how you like to be seen and everything um is gonna vary okay it's gonna be different so all you gotta do is um you know you can just go and it depends on your product depends on how you like it but this is a pretty good example that i'm gonna show you guys here okay so this is the um you know the a plus content uh in case you didn't know it's always gonna be at the product product description page so you know we have like the you know pictures um, title and then if we scroll down we're always gonna have the option for the a plus content okay here's where we find it so that's pretty much what we need to do see this is um okay yeah the company logo 600 by 180 um this is exactly how it looks like okay if this is if this was your logo um you know they are telling you how you know the pixels the dimensions and all that that it, it has to be and this is this product's case so 
they just went and put this here and uploaded the picture like if you click on this you're gonna be able to upload a picture okay so that's it's just so so easy it's so nice to do this like it's visually so rewarding to see like then uh you know how it how it looks like it looks clean it looks fancy it looks just um, it just looks nice okay so this is exactly how um you know um well not, not everyone's case is gonna be the same but like if you choose like um uh, well it's gonna vary on how many how much text do you have okay in, in this product didn't have any really didn't really have like a much text so um you know you, you don't really need that uh, much space okay for text so but you have if you have a lot of text you definitely want to have your text okay and a picture because that's the whole point okay people don't want to read people just don't want to uh you know spend a uh, five ten minutes reading people all people want to do is just see okay see and buy that, that that's it it should be easy it shouldn't um be like you know a whole bible there trying to convince the customer on why you're the best product out there okay it doesn't really work like that um you know all you gotta do is like plug in some text here here and there but it's mostly gonna be by um you know it's mainly gonna be pictures that, 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 that's all that's all okay so on the add module uh, I told you guys that, you know, add module one, two, three, and four in depends on, on your product. And that's pretty much it. I mean, let's see. Um, let, let's just pretend that you guys are gonna, are gonna need a lot of text. Okay. So what we can do is we can just look up and, uh, well, this is the standard text. We really don't want that because it doesn't have like any image. So that's just gonna look weird um let's just put this one okay so here's where you're gonna um you know enter the text like the headline and by headline they mean this thing okay docs at work and amazon employees blah blah blah. so that's basically what they mean by that um you're gonna enter your text right there and um like you can edit this see if we go here enter the test you can put whatever literally so whatever and on the body text um you know you can also put whatever see this is exactly how it works it, it's pretty nice to do it like it's it's pretty rewarding once you have like your um you know your a plus content done and, and finished it's it's just really nice to see okay so and then we have all the um you know you can always change this um it doesn't have to be um, like th this product's case this product's a plus content it doesn't have to be like the exact exactly the same as yours okay you can just start with maybe with i don't know maybe with this one see that it's got some detailed pages here um very very few words which i really like and then uh a much longer explanation um here okay so and it's uh, it's also got a picture remember always include the picture okay i really don't recommend doing like the standard product description text because you know it's just text okay that's so boring and then the standard text uh don't do that either don't do this either because um you know people want to see pictures and videos okay people don't want to read people are we are all lazy okay i, I don't like to read uh, i know you don't like to read also you just want to see um you know you just want to see something easy something nice and and buy it okay if it's like if it's if it convinces you um remember that we have a lot of text in our title and description okay so right there we already have a lot of text okay so we really don't need um more text in the pictures okay so you can just do that um see what it um what works very best for you for your profile for your picture um and just choose something that you like okay if you like this one um just you know you can have like multiple pictures a few just a few uh words here uh small description do that okay um see amazon gives you a lot of options a lot of variations so you can play around with them and um um yeah you know you can just play play with them see what a um how it looks like you can of course you can always change this um uh, like it let's say that you already have all of your modules uh ready like done um you can always edit this like it's not that you know if you set this up this way 
that you're not going to be able to change it afterwards of course you can uh, you know you can change pretty much everything that has to do with your with your amazon listing um you can you can do that like anytime seriously so that's just gonna be you know in the worst case scenario if you don't like it um you really don't have to do anything else besides just like editing it i mean it's not too much work anyway um so yeah this is exactly how you do it guys um then the next step i i'm not gonna do it because i don't want to make like you know this video way too long but if you want to but if you want to do it uh, right now it's not it's not gonna let me because if i click here on next apply license it says content validation failed if this content fails to pass validation please fix the highlighted errors to proceed so this is one the content name you can just put you know test or whatever and then here okay it's gonna require you to upload at least one image okay because i mean they have to approve this okay it's not that you can just upload whatever and amazon is gonna approve it no they have to like see your images your text see what you're uploading okay and if it's like um you know if it doesn't if it's not within the amazon terms of service they're just gonna take it down or if it has nothing to do with your product which uh i'm not sure why you would do that um amazon will it's just gonna you know it's just gonna take it down okay so this is gonna take a few days to get approved mine took like around a week uh, which is completely normal okay so don't freak out if you don't see any updates within 24 hours so yeah that's exactly how you do it guys and if you, and if you need help with your a plus content here at amc one said we help amazon brands start and grow their brand listing images conversion rate and much more so if you need help with any of that please feel free to visit our website and schedule a call with us okay we can definitely help you with your actual um a plus content like if, just in case if you're wondering how how am i gonna take the pictures like how do i get this to look this nice okay because this a plus content is fire it, it, it was made of course by amc one step that's why it looks so clean so sharp so nice okay if you if you want your a plus content if you want your product to look like this um just it's pretty easy just go to amc one step slash contact and get in touch with us my name is oscar thanks for um as always thanks for watching this video and please take care thank you bye